Good afternoon, family, friends, faculty, honored guests, and University of Maryland University College graduates. My name is First Lieutenant Kara Novus of the United States Marine Corps, and I am a proud University of Maryland University College cybersecurity student. It is a true privilege to be here with you all today as we honor and congratulate those students near and far whose hard work and dedication has brought them here. I would like to thank the UMUC faculty and staff for accompanying us on this journey. Your tireless commitment to our education has been an invaluable asset and a life-changing gift. I would also like to extend my heartfelt gratitude to all of the family members and friends without whose support this achievement would not be possible. In the Marine Corps, we like to say that it isn't just the individual in uniform who serves, but also their family, friends, and loved ones. I am humbled and grateful to have not only my parents, but my partner, Junior, here with me today as we close one chapter and look forward to starting another one when we welcome our first child in just a couple months. Today is also my parents' 35th wedding anniversary, so happy anniversary, mom and dad. When I started down this path in 2015, Junior and I were negotiating a lot of changes in our lives. With Junior's support, I had made the unlikely decision to leave a comfortable and fulfilling job in Washington, D.C. to commission as an officer in the United States Marine Corps. A lot of people asked and questioned my choice. They said, why? Why would I want to put myself through the physical and mental tribulations required of a U.S. Marine? And the answer was not simple or easy. Becoming a Marine was one of the most trying undertakings of my life. I needed to lose weight, train hard, and leave the job that I loved. It also meant months away from my husband and a lifestyle change that would affect both of us for years to come. Nevertheless, I had seen what an impact the Marine Corps had on Junior, a Marine Corps veteran and Purple Heart recipient who served multiple tours of duty in Iraq and Afghanistan, and also the struggles that he faced in dealing with his injuries after getting out. Walking with him to the, on the road to recovery was at times deeply devastating, at times profoundly joyous, and always indescribably humbling. Given our journey together, I believe that we would be uniquely able to lead Marines, to mold young recruits, and to understand their struggles and celebrate their triumphs. At the very heart of it, I believe not only in the values that the Marine Corps holds dear, but in the constant pursuit of personal betterment, in relentlessly pursuing your own limits as you strive to move forward and give back. It was this same pursuit of personal betterment that led me to seek out a degree at UMUC in an effort to better myself so that I may in turn help better my fellow service members. UMUC has earned a well-deserved reputation as a pillar of academic excellence with global reach. UMUC understands that for many aspiring scholars, the decision to pursue higher education can be just as daunting as joining the armed services and they have made it their mission to extend this transformative opportunity to as many people as possible. If you are passionate about continuous learning, you are already UMUC material. And the outstanding educators and mentors you meet while studying here not only foster that passion, but facilitate your success. I am confident that I speak for all UMUC graduates when I say we cannot express in words our gratitude to you all for making this dream of higher education a reality. And to my fellow graduates, I urge you to maintain the focus, commitment, and drive that brought you to your studies here at UMUC. Finishing your degree is in no way an end, but a beginning. And the same spirit of curiosity and bravery that led you to pursue your degree will be vital as you look to apply everything you've learned going forward. We have a tremendous opportunity before us to give back, to make an impact, and to change the world. To do this, we must keep within us the thirst to constantly improve and push past our limits. Recall, what spurred you to seek a degree from UMUC? And remember that learning doesn't stop when you leave the ivory tower. 
When I think of the values I hope to instill in my son or daughter, I think of the tremendous grit of the people I have met while pursuing my degree, of their sacrifices, their dedication, and their determination. I'm confident the future is in good hands. And who knows, maybe my child will stand here as a proud UMUC graduate one day as well. Thank you. University of Maryland University College is now University of Maryland Global Campus.